previously on The Walking Dead. You don't have to fill his cup up anymore, baby. Grandpa is sleeping. No, Yaya. Pippo's awake. Solamente está confundido. Mama. Oh my god! Oh my god! Hey! Put your hands up and close your eyes. Thanks. Mari! Oh, shit! Kate! Javi, don't! Hey, what do we call you? Sorry, forgot to introduce myself. It's Paul, but my friends call me Jesus. I fucking knew it. You're one of them? You're goddamn right she is. If you want to shoot me, Shoot me. How about I shoot your little boyfriend here instead? I'm sorry, Clem. What the hell's going on out here? Oh my god. I hate being out so close to dark. To see them coming. We're just gonna get that propane and then come right back. I, I saw it in that pickup truck parked down the road a little, in front of the Wallace's house. I just wish there was an easier way to get it, and that we didn't have to risk life and limb every damn day for food and water and gas for the stove. Oh, am I babbling? I babble when I'm scared. Nothing's easy anymore, Kate. But that doesn't mean we don't have to try. I know. It's just hard to get used to, that's all. We get over there, we grab the tank, and we get the hell back home. If we're lucky, we won't see a single one of those things. <sighs> Fingers crossed. There it is! Let's take it and go. that lucky. I mean, it's not like we needed it or anything. Hey, keep it down. I know it sucks, Kate, but you gotta watch out. I'm sorry. I'm just sick of this shit. I just thought this one time we deserve to catch a fucking break. friends. 
True. He was so sweet. He always had a smile on his face. Cape worshipped him. That's not Drew anymore. I know, it, it still looks like him, but... The kid you knew, he's gone. All that's left is this... thing. I don't even know what to call them. If they're not people, if they're just the dead... <sighs> Muertos. That's what we'll call them. I thought we were gonna die. I thought Gabe and Mariana were just gonna wake up and we would just be gone. When it was on you? Oh my god. I'm right here, okay? I'm here. You're here. We're still alive. That's what matters. Can we go back now? I know we all wanted to stay here in the house and wait for David to come back, but it's been three months since he drove away with your mom. What are you saying? We're not safe here. Not anymore. You and I could have been killed out there for an empty can. There's got to be a safer place out there. Somewhere not so isolated. So, we'll leave. Go somewhere else. Somewhere safer. Somewhere with crazy thick walls, okay? And a gate that's 20 feet tall. You really think the kids are gonna be happy with this plan? The kids will understand. A and if they don't, we'll just make them see it our way. We have to go. How come? What if I don't want to leave? Cabe. We're safe inside the house. A and I bet we can find more food in the neighborhood if we just look harder. We need to find somewhere with more people around. People who are still alive. People who don't mind sharing their supplies. We have our own supplies. Not enough. Not anymore. But what about Dad? What's he gonna think if he shows up and we, we just ditched him? We might never find him again. Your dad would want us to do this game. He'd want us to survive. We've been surviving. Here. At home. Barely. I'm sorry, Gabe. But, Javi's right. Uh, how about you guys go and I stay here? You're a kid. That's not how it works. I can take care of myself. If I need any help, I'll just ask my friends. Gabe, honey. What? What's, what's wrong with her? Why is she acting so weird? Uncle Javi? I'll tell you when you're older, okay? Just tell me. I can handle it. I don't think so. We can't lie to him, Javi. He needs to know. Your friend, Drew, from down the street? He... He didn't make it. He... He turned into one of them. So you understand why, don't you? Why we have to leave? If that happened to you, I couldn't bear it. When do we have to go? Tomorrow, as soon as it's daylight. I want to leave him a note. I'll help you get started, okay? What are we going to tell him? I want to say something good. Something that won't make him sad. Tell him we'll find him. Somehow, we're all gonna see each other again. I like that. I'm gonna write it right now, so we don't forget. Of course. I'll help him. Thank you. Really.
Dad? Javi! Is that really you? <laughs> I always hoped I'd find you. Never really thought it happened. Not after all this time. God, you have no idea how good it is to see your face. I think I got a pretty decent idea, actually. I knew you were still alive. I knew it! Hey, weapons down! This is my family! You gotta let us in. Kate doesn't have much longer. Jesus. Kate! David? I'm here, honey. I'm right here. What the hell happened? She's been shot. And we got the bullet out, but she's still bleeding. We need your doctor. Now, David. Thanks, Javi. For getting her here. She's coming inside! But she hasn't been checked! This is my wife, Max. You want her to die? No! I didn't say that! Our doctor's gonna help you, honey. I'm gonna make sure of it. Wait, I I'm going with you. Sorry, but the rest of you have to go straight to quarantine. What for? All newcomers get checked for bites, and they all have to answer a couple of questions. Our doctor will clear the two of them, but the rest of you have to come with me to the quarantine holding area. It's how we keep it safe for everyone. Yeah, right. Don't you get it? I'm David's brother. I'm going to the hospital with them. We have procedures here. Procedures that have to be followed. Even if you are related to David. Ah, this is bullshit. Come on. The sooner you come along, the sooner we can get you cleared. I'll be there as soon as I can. Let's go. the car without you in it, I didn't know what to think. The engine up and died. I came here looking for help, and this happened. I've been so worried about Kate. I told them she needed a doctor. They promised me someone would look into it. Please, tell me they found her. They definitely didn't look for her, because she was still in the car. But that's crazy! I told them she was dying! And clearly, it wasn't a priority. Well, at least those assholes realized she needed a hospital once they saw her. I'm sorry, Javi. Really, but I didn't have any reason not to believe them. What? The people here in Richmond. Their new frontier. Oh my god. Ho oh, ho ho, you ain't even heard the worst part yet. One of them's his brother. I didn't even know you had a brother, Javi. Hey, nobody's more surprised than me. I, I thought the guy was dead. We haven't seen David in years. It's just been me, Kate, and the kids this whole time. I don't even want to think about what the odds are, but he did seem pretty damn surprised to see you. Whoever this guy is, he can't be all bad, right? I mean, he helped Kate instead of hauling her down here. Of course he brought her inside. She's his damn wife. You're kidding. Kate is married to your brother? The way you two acted around each other. I just didn't think she had a husband out there, is all. The only reason I know Kate is because she married David. I was the best man at their wedding. Wow. Okay. Family drama aside. Hope you know I'm not about to make nice with New Frontier. I know you didn't have much stake in Prescott, Javi, but they burned that place to the ground for no fucking reason. After everything you folks told me, I'm guessing I'm not gonna find my people alive. Hell, Javi. They killed your niece! Shot Kate! For all we know, your brother could have been behind it. And even if it wasn't his idea in the first place, 
if he knew about it and didn't stop it. That shit can't stand. I hate to admit it, but there's a chance he gave the order. If he didn't know it was them, if he was just trying to get payback for what was stolen, it's possible. Clementine, you were part of the New Frontier. Did you know David? I knew him. If I'm being honest, he's not a good guy. Is that right? If you told me he was the one behind Prescott, I wouldn't be surprised. He does have a temper. I've taken the brunt of it a few times. I can imagine. What happened at the gates? The fact that he's your brother? That doesn't change anything. I'm gonna find the man who killed Francine. These people better not get in my way. I'm gonna be asking questions about what went down at Prescott. And I won't stop until I get answers. As soon as I get a moment alone with David, I'll get to the bottom of this. He can tell me what we're up against. He has to. Family's gotta be good for something, right? Hey. Hey. I would have been here sooner, but I had to take care of... something. Come on already, Kate's asking for you. Maybe you think it's okay to keep a lady waiting. Thought I taught you better than that. That in order, David? Fucking with me already, huh? Some things never change. Looks like the rules don't apply to everyone, huh? That's right. Some people get out of here early. Others stay a long fucking time. Trip, just drop it, okay? Smart cookie, this one. Javi, just go. I'll be back as soon as I can. You know that. Thanks. Family must be good for something. Nice, Javi. We have a process. Our own way of doing things. Your guys better not have a problem with that. Things don't go well for troublemakers here. I hope that's clear. No problem. You won't have to worry about them. Didn't sound that way. They just need time to get used to things. I hope you're right. Come on. Where are we going? Kate asked for you. I thought you'd want to check on her. Listen, Javi, Gabe... He told me some pretty messed up things. Things I need your help wrapping my head around. I don't know what Gabe's been telling you. You're saying he's a liar? He's been through a lot. Sometimes he blurs reality and fiction. I doubt he'd blur his sister's death. He told me you lost Mariana. Just a few days ago. I'm sorry, David. She's... She's gone. It's strange grieving for the same person twice. Like losing something you didn't know you had. What was she like, Javi? She was so little when we got separated. Who did my little girl become? Mariana saw things that the other people didn't. She, uh... She told me she wanted to write down her memories. 
to keep them alive after she was gone. Sounds like her. Always was a dreamer. How? How did she die? Tell me how it happened. Please, I need to know. She was just standing there, minding her own business. She just found her lost headphones in the dirt. She was smiling. And then someone put a bullet in her head. What kind of animal would just open fire on her like that? An animal with your mark. My people aren't in the habit of killing little girls. David, I was there. They shot Kate, too. Ask your buddy at the gate if you don't believe me. Max was a part of this? Fuck. I need details. What the hell went down out there? I need to know exactly what happened. Everything you remember. Same assholes killed a hostage at this town, Prescott. Prescott? At the airstrip? Their leader flooded it with walkers and, and tear gas. Leader? A crazy bald guy with a beard. Badger, what the fuck have you done now? I'm gonna handle that stupid son of a bitch, okay? Do me a favor, keep this to yourself. The politics here, they can get messy. I thought you were the boss. There's four of us that run, Richmond. You need to impress the other three. Or you'll be back on the road by morning. Try not to stir things up. You and your friends could have a very short stay. I can be impressive when I try. I'll follow your lead. Just don't get cute. I run security here, but it's not like my word is law. This shit with Badger doesn't make things any easier. Who's the fresh meat? Ava. This is my brother, Javi. The baseball brother? <laughs> no shit. What are the chances of you turning up on the doorstep? Welcome to civilization. Or at least the closest thing to it these days. My brother talked about me. All the time, at the start. All good, I hope. I think you know the answer to that. Ava's my right hand. If there's anyone you can trust in Richmond, it's her. That woman, the fucking soldier. She was the first person I met up with after you and me got separated. I never would have made it without her. Gabe said you went back to the house. At the start. I'm sorry I never found you. Don't give me that look. I did what I had to. Mama and I got routed out of the city on the way to the hospital. It wasn't long before she... Poor Mama. I couldn't get back into Baltimore, so I hooked up with my old unit. We thought we could build a safe zone outside D.C. After what happened to Mama and everyone else, I thought you were all dead. But you were taking care of them, weren't you? Somehow you found a way. I'm not gonna lie. I never thought you had it in you. The day Dad died, I promised I'd stick around. Be there for the family. Well, came my word. It took the end of the world, but you finally grew up. This is where they're treating Kate. Don't get comfortable. We're not staying long. Hey! Hey, kid. Got everything you need? Uh, yeah. This place is like a resort. Check it out, Javi. Noodles in a cup. We need to get you some real food. Stat. Turn you into a soldier. <laughs> Javi, 
I'm glad you're okay. You know me. I'm always okay. Damn, it's good to have you back. Look at this family. Look at my wife. Isn't she the most beautiful woman alive? Come on. With the lights off, you could mistake me for a walker. A damn fine walker. Gross. I'd have to agree. The key word being alive. Game. Uh, what, you okay? Uh, I... oh, shit. I'll get the duck. I'm fine. I just needed to talk to you, alone. I'm scared, Javi. More than I was the whole time on the road. Even when I thought I was going to die, everything inside me screams to get away from here. These people are killers. And David? David threw his own brother in a cell. What about Gabe? He seems pretty happy to see his dad. Gabe will do what we say. We've been taking care of him. It's always been you and me on the road, Javi. That's how we've made it this far. Please, promise me we'll go back to that the first chance we get. This place, it's a cage. We can't let ourselves get locked in. I hear you, Kate, but we can't just turn our backs on this place. On my brother. Javi. We have to try to make it work. I used to say that about my fucked up marriage. Guess it still applies. Whatever. Just please, please don't leave me alone for too long. Feeling better? How you doing, sweetheart? David reported some pain. It's less now. Strange how it just comes and goes. I think she pulled her stitches when she sat up. Her stitches? I doubt it. But pain often comes in waves with abdominal wounds. <laughs> I'll give you something to take the edge off, in case it comes back. Truly superlative work. I thought I'd have to operate, but all she needed was IV fluids and some antibiotics. How did you find someone with skills like these? A wound like this kills nine out of ten. Whoever did this really knows their stuff. That would be Eleanor. One of my friends you threw in quarantine. Well, she's no use to anyone there. We should let her out. I'll vouch for her. Agreed. I'll have Ava bring her here. I want to meet this Eleanor. I'm sure she'll be an asset to our community. The rest of those guys can contribute, if that's what it takes to get free. They're all pretty handy in a fight. That's why they're all under guard. Javi and I have to go meet some people now. See if we can't prove he's worth a damn. We're gonna take real good carry. Okay? Send my apologies, David. I won't be able to make it. Feeling okay? Fine. I just want to keep an eye on my patient. The others know my vote is with you. Come on. Remember what I said. When we meet these guys, keep what happened to Mariana to yourself. Badger is one of my guys. And I will handle him. It may look pretty, but it's all sugars. There's no substance. It tastes pretty, Clint. That's all that matters. Ah, the brother. Javi, meet the guys. Clint runs food production. The crops you saw, that's him and his people. Jones, our bridge to the outside world. She handles contact with other settlements. Pleased to meet you, Javi. I trust you've been treated well. I hope you haven't been handled too roughly. Some of our people left their courtesy with their old lives. <laughs> Absolutely. I feel like I'm home at last. I hope Richmond can become your home. 
I know David would like that. And nothing pleases me more than seeing families reunited. <laughs> we were just about to eat. Clint was trying to convince me of the essential superiority of his cream spinach over my magnificent Black Forest Gateau. It's no contest. The spinach has real nutritional value. Javi, take a look at that table. You tell me what you'd rather put in your belly. Spinach from Clint's garden or a baked delicacy by yours truly? I'd have to go with that cake. I haven't seen anything like that in years. <sighs> Suit yourself. Come on, Clint. At least he's being honest. Please, make yourself comfortable. We value straight talk here, so please, forgive me if I seem direct. We're usually pretty strict about who we open our doors to. Your brother's word counts for a lot. Is that so? The three of us and Dr. Lingard make all the decisions here, so... Yeah. People who choose to stay with us, they have to deal with us bossing them around. Not saying you wouldn't, but it can be an adjustment. Especially for the more independent-minded. There's no structure out there now. People get used to doing as they please. You'll toe the line. He'll answer to me if he doesn't. When Joan and I met your brother, he was trying his hand at fruit. Fruit? We found him slowly murdering an orchard on the Shenandoah River. Hotty fucking ha. Huh? I helped him bring it back to life. We had a good run there. For as long as it lasted. What happened? What always happens. We trusted the wrong damn people. That's what led us to start this. Wondering what this fine piece of body art is all about? It's our litmus test for loyalty. That looks pretty intense. Doesn't it hurt? It's burned into your flesh. Of course it fucking hurts. It's a sign of commitment, not a Buddhist symbol from your year abroad. It was a crude answer to a difficult problem, and it hasn't always worked. Please understand. We had a terrible winter just after we moved here. We... we lost a great deal. Loved ones who left holes in our lives. Protecting my people from that kind of pain, that's what keeps me awake at night. It turned me into a perpetual night owl. I know it's a lot to ask, but I never want them to have to experience loss like that again. I know how you feel. Seeing the people I care about suffer, it's a terrible feeling. I just want to shield them from it all. It's a noble aim, one worth fighting for. Max, what are you doing here? I sent for him. Since when does he answer to you? From what I hear, he's well acquainted with your brother. They exchanged a few bullets outside our walls. Is that right? Is there bad blood between you and Max? Nothing that can't be worked out. I want to hear that from Javi. I don't have a problem with him. He's all right by me. Yeah. Same here. I don't buy it. Max, how did this start? Don't look at him. You have an obligation to tell the truth. We caught him siphoning gas from one of our vehicles. Max. Sorry, David. I know he's family, but your brother's a thief. Is it true? Answer her. Did you steal gas from us? I was scavenging whatever I could find. I had no idea it belonged to you. If you just asked, we'd have given it to you. That, that's not all. Rufus said Clementine ran his truck off the road just to break him free. We had real problems with her in the past. You can always judge a man by the company he keeps. Running with that girl don't look good. I would say not. Clementine's not a bad person, at least from what I've seen. Of course you'd say that. You got that honor among thieves. This is who you're asking us to vouch for, David? Seriously? You know we can't just open our doors to bandits. We're trying to build something different here. Something resembling civilization. Everything I did out there was to protect my people. That's more than I can say for you. I'm not sure what you mean. Javi? You have something to say?
No. That's it. That's right. He knows what he done. There ain't nothing more to say. Uh, it's clear your brother doesn't belong here. Javi and his people have to go. You're overreacting. It was a scuffle over supplies. Uh, we've exiled people for less. Sorry, David. Your soldiers are already wild enough. We can't add more crazy to the mix. Take Javi and everyone in quarantine to the gate. Give him a pack with a bare minimum to survive. Look, we can't fight this. Not now. Kate and Gabe will be safe here. Your doctor friend too. But the rest of you, you're gonna have to do what they say. I'm sorry. It's out of my hands. This is ridiculous. You have to do something. I... I can't right now. But maybe I can down the road. Just stay alive. Okay? What the fuck? We didn't do anything. I might do something here in a minute. David packed this. He did. They said... Start walking. What about Eleanor? Walk. Eat shit. Answer my fucking question. God damn it, Harvey! Let go of me! This isn't gonna help Eleanor. Don't make it worse for her. Do not fuck this up. There's a settlement a few miles west of here. Don't come back. Seems your moment alone with David screwed us over pretty good. We trusted you. What the hell, man? Everything was going okay. At first. I don't know what happened back there. Yeah, well, I got a pretty good idea what's gonna happen out here. Let's just see what they gave us. Knowing them, it's probably a butter knife and a stick of gum. They could have just shot us. More than once. Oh, how fucking neighborly. What's that? It looks like a map. I doubt they give one to everyone. Ava did say David packed the bag. Why the hell is it tied to a baseball bat? David's sense of humor was always poorly timed. There's Richmond. That helps. But we can't go back there. Knowing where it is lets us know where we are. Looks like they're expanding. Some of these areas are marked clear. Pretty sure David wants us to go there. And if this is us here, then I think we can head along this path. Just gotta head north. And to find north, we need to find the North Star. There. The end of the Little Dipper. No, that's the Big Dipper. Is that it? Uh, I remember something about it facing toward the Little Dipper. That's it. We need to go this way. What else is in there? Not a whole lot. Flashlight. Not enough weapons. No food.
deal with it. Take it. Please. Take it. Call it an apology. That man back there in the tunnel, that wasn't me. Take the gun. Conrad, don't let the past get in the way of common sense. Give him the gun, Javi. I can find something along the way. Always have. I don't like it. The gun is yours, Conrad. I can handle myself. Nobody fires a single shot unless you are deep fucking fried. You hear me? We don't want to attract whatever the hell's out there. I gotta tell you, man, I thought you and Kate were, you know, I wouldn't have guessed she was married to not you. I ain't judging, mind you, I'm just curious. What's the story? Ain't my business, I know, but what have we got to lose out here? She's my brother's wife, she's family. End of story. Come on, man. You're not a dumbass. When it comes to these kind of things, the story never really ends. Not for everyone, at least. It's always a mess, ain't it? What's that? Who you love, who loves you. If they're one and the same or otherwise. You know what I mean? <laughs> Just when you think you got everything figured out, boom. Heart goes ass over tea kettle. You no, know, if it wasn't messy, it wouldn't be important. Right? Maybe. Yeah, maybe. Just saying, man. Three things that never hide forever. The sun, the moon, and the truth. I know Eleanor told you that she and I were... whatever we were, but... that's over now. I respect her wishes. I really do. I just... Wish my heart respected mine. Jesus got his eye on something. What you got for us, man? Listen. Tell me that isn't what I think it is. About a quarter mile out. Heading the same way we are. Well, we could hit walkers any second. We better scoot. Walkers, get ready. They're near. Okay, look alive, people. I got it. Come on, man, move your ass. You want a piece of this?
You should be more careful with this. We're even now. This is a bad idea. We're following David's map right into a herd. For all we know, he's trying to get rid of us. Come on, Clem. He's my brother. You can't trust him, Javi. I learned that the hard way. This brand is a lie. It's a lie that says you can trust us. You belong. They don't care about their people. They promised they'd help him. But they were gonna let him die.